take me, Jesus. I am ready to meet you. It's we're back. It's a Tuesday. And once again, you know the topic. David, I want you to pray for us. I need this right now. Kill the music. I need you to pray. Now, no, get on the microphone. Here's how we're starting the show. I must say we're breaking down Malik Saul ineptitude. Who? I was joking. Malik Hall. Oh, stop. I was, uh, Mike, I'm trying to get you in a good mood. I am in a good mood. David, here's what I need. I need you to pray that nothing else breaks during this show, <laughs> forcing us to talk longer about U of M and this nonsense bleeping match between them Hold and the on. Big Ten. Can you? Hold who, on. And David, while we're at it, can we end world hunger and racism and bring peace to the world? I kind of have to add that in to kind of. Because I yeah. think I think all four of those things are achievable. And I only <laughs> there is no. I'm sorry. No, just... no, no. Now, for those of you who think, oh, they loved. I said this to caller Sheldon yesterday. Shout out Sheldon if you're listening. This is not. I don't want to talk about this today. I'm going to do what I have to do. But this latest report, well. I don't know that you'll like what we have to say on it, but away we go. So the Associated Press, Mr. Larry Lage. Rico, you have the details of the report. I know you've spoken to Larry. It is very simple. Well, well, we'll see. They're speeding, too. That's what today is. Mm -hmm. So now, well, look, other coaches have signs. All right. Do we know if they illegally obtained them? Full pepperoni? Well, other teams were conspiring against Michigan. Okay, great. Noted. Have you sent it to the NCAA? Is there an investigation? Here, here's what I'd like to tell you uh, on today's day. Whatever you, whatever Michigan thinks they have on other schools, I'd like you to send it to 700 West Washington Street, Indianapolis, Indiana, 46202, care of... NCAA. Please, you're doing God's work. Turn it in. And the same thing we're saying about you, I'll say about Rutgers or Ohio State or burn the whole conference down. I don't care. It has no impact on me. The good thing we're bringing in four new teams because they may be the only four playing. This is just, to me, it's what I predicted last week, is you would see a counteroffensive. You just got pulled over going 90 and a 70. Well, look, they're going fast too. But I pulled you over. You're doing what about is something Wojo hates. You cheated. What about this? Now, look, if you can show me that these teams had a scouting network sending scouts live to tape games, not to groupthink and share information, but to illegally scout, I, you could burn them all to the ground, suspend all their coaches. But what I'm not going to do is fall for the light show. This is like when you want your dog to do something or like, hey, we're doing a family portrait and you've got like an idiot baby who won't look at the camera and smile. And the photographer has to dress up as Mickey Mouse and go, Mimi, pitchy, woo, woo. So the kid smiles. <laughs> I'm not falling for that. What? I'm you, not, you can't do this type of stuff and expect me not to what? continue. Oh, look at the camera. Beep, 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 woo, woo. And you're like, yeah, we're at JCPenney and this sucks. So look, okay, you think you've got some other schools. Great. It doesn't change you. Here's what's actually happening. You're trying to get mutually assured destruction. You're trying to say, our ass is in the jackpot. We're going Nino Brown at the end of New Jack City. Shout out Rico Beard. That's exactly what you're doing. That may as well be Santa Ono. <laughs> that is Santa Ono when he met with Petiti. And I'm just, I find it all to be absurd. So, look. You want to take other schools down? Go for it. 700 West Washington Street, Indianapolis, Indiana, 462. 
Oh, two. You know Tony Petiti because he's on your campus. Send Tony to file. It doesn't change where you're at. This isn't a plea bargain. This isn't a court of law. What are you, Sammy the Bull Gravano? You're going to turn state's evidence? We're going to take them all down? Like, that's good. Go do it. By the way, I love the report, too. MSU blissfully unaware. I mean, you could, it, no wonder our coach was more concerned with getting laid. <laughs> he was on the burner phone. Hey, Tuck, where are you at on the group text? Dot, dot, dot. Tuck, I know the next play call. Peach emoji, peach emoji, hammer, eggplant, raindrop. <laughs> Oh, face gif. Right. <laughs> eyeballs. <laughs> eyeball, 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 thick. Oh! Eyeball, oh! eyeball, eyeball, peach. Oh! I mean, honestly, you go ahead. Right. Our coach was the only one not smart enough to partake in this group chat. I, I think Tuck's texting the wrong person. Right. I mean, come on. <laughs> Mail, you okay? Eggplant. <laughs> Eggplant hammer, fire, <laughs> wet drops. So, look, we can get into it. What does today's report do? Does it change your perspective? I, guys, here's the dirty secret. I don't think anything's going to change anyone's perspective. Battle lines are drawn. The one thing I can say is Rico and I have not gone on the air screaming like hyenas to shut your program down. That's not honest. I haven't gone as far as to say, well, you shouldn't be in the playoff. I haven't done it. Because I live in the real world. But what's happening here? This is simple. Michigan's on a counteroffensive. It's probably the only move they can make. Oh, they'll file an injunction. Oh, okay, great. You want you want to go that route? Do it. I think that ends badly for you. Yeah. But in the short term, you're doing what a little kid does. You got caught taking a cookie, and you're pointing over to little Jenny going, well, she took two. All right. And both of these are going to get punished. I don't care. It doesn't change what you did. So I can absolutely acknowledge, okay, do we have something we need to pay attention to at Rutgers? Do we have something we need to pay attention to at Ohio State? Show me. You think I like anybody in this conference? My team's terrible. I hate everybody. I don't know if I should be happy or sad that Tucker missed out on this. Peach, (laughs) peach, (laughs) peach, wet. Like... Mail, you'd be in trouble. You'd just be in trouble for different things. No, I mean, honestly, the, co- the coach is busy partying, flying to Vegas, and I, you know, doing whatever else he was doing that isn't out there. And then, yes, the ridiculous situation with phone sex. I'm just making a point. You can't blame us because <laughs> we were too stupid to be a part of it. <laughs> right. But I guess my point would be, okay, you think these other schools are going down? Is that is that the plan? Did they obtain their information illegally? Yes or no? That is not a part of the report, true or false? That is true. No, it's not. No, it's, they, they, it didn't okay. say that they obtained it illegally. Have, it we, uncovered they shared a, have we uncovered a travel log of people that were paid to attend other people's games to record illegal footage no. and upload it? Do no. we have that? No. All right. So in the absence of those two things, what is this actual report besides, well, Jennifer's mom lets her take the car on Friday night, then go live with Jennifer. Yeah. What happened was, um, you know what? I think they found out that they stole our signal. So how about we just all get together and here's what we came up with. And here's what we came up. And if here's they, what we came up. If they with. did something illegal, guess what? Burn them to the ground. But I thought, I thought Michigan shared information with South Carolina. Michigan fans said that that was no big deal. Mm, David. Huh? I need you to put that goalpost right back where it was. Oh, you're, um, you're right. Okay. I'll go do that now. Da- David. Go David. put the goalpost right back where it was, young man. Don't move it. But no, it went from everybody does it, everybody breaks the code breaker and all that. Yeah, they broke your code. They they shared it. It That's nothing new. That Yes, if, if I'm a head coach and Mike's a head coach and he's getting ready to play Kenny's team, And Mike calls me, hey, didn't you just beat them? Yeah, this is what we did. Right. Okay, cool. Thanks. Appreciate it. Now, if you can make the connection here, much like you guys say, well, you you haven't made a connection about Harbaugh. Again, all I've told you is he doesn't have to know to be punished. But I don't have that connection. Common sense would tell you he had to know. However, with this report, A, the timing of it is intentional. And it's smart by U of M. Who are we kidding? 
and it has one fatal flaw. You can't do a false equivalency that what was in the AP report is what Connor Stallions was doing for you. You just, you can't do that. I mean, I I don't want to break up a good narrative party. Now, I'm happy to watch the whole world burn from a good safe distance because my team stinks. You want to take down Rutgers? Great. I don't even like the state of New Jersey. You want to you want to you want to you want to take down Ohio State? Sounds good. We're going to lose them by 50 this weekend. But it doesn't change you. Like I don't know what spy movie you're watching where you think if you dime out other people, you're now going to be free and go live in Yuma, Arizona under witness protection. No. You did what you did. No, no, no. Well, here's what they're hoping for. They're hoping that if we threaten to blow the whistle on everybody that the other schools are going to say, "Oh, Wait, you're going to talk about that Vegas trip we took a few years ago? Oh, oh, you know what? Never mind. Never mind. Hey, hey, Petiti, it's all good. We're good. We don't want. That's what they're hoping for. It's it's the scare tactic. But you're too far down the road. This is true, but they're saying. If Petiti dovetailed out now, he'd be gone. He'd lose the will of the other 13 schools, or 17 if you count the four schools coming in. Okay, here's your dirty little secret. Petiti and Central Michigan are going to get hit the hardest. Oh, CMU is going to get clobbered. When this is all said and done, Michigan will rise again. The other 13 teams in the Big Ten will be fine. Central Michigan will be buried. Petiti will be scapegoated and fired. Because in the end, none of the 14 teams are going to like him. Michigan's not going to like him because he went after him. The other 13 teams won't like him because they don't feel like they got justice. So he can't win right now. And Central, yeah, good luck with that. I I, I don't know what your punishment's going to be. I mean, it's not like, you know, you got to forfeit victories or whatnot, but something's going to happen. I Rico said this, I don't know what, right when the story first broke, I've been saying it for a week. It, it's the same thing. Everyone wants the same goal. If you're a Michigan fan, you want to play for it all. The route to doing it would be putting this behind you quickly. How do you do that? You push Jim down the escalator. You basically just, you're gone for a few games. Who cares? We're going to win without you. But instead, you've chosen violence. Which, again, I, it, it you're doing the equivalent of what some of your East Coast students do. Do you know who my daddy is? That's what you're doing. Yeah. Do you know who my father is? Like, that's what this is. You can't do this to me. Right, because there's been a Duke brother on this stock exchange since the day it opened. This is Duke and Duke. Turn those machines back on. That's what you're doing. It is. So I, the report is fun. It doesn't show illegal scouting. It doesn't show a travel agency network. Now, if... Larry's and, and, next report does, and you want to play the card of everyone's doing this brand new dance now? Okay, but and that's that, not what this report is. Yeah, and that's just it, that he said that this wasn't, what they did was nowhere near what Stallings did. This was just, okay, they're going to share information. They're going to do this to us. We're going to all come together. Here's what we know. Here's what we know. Here's what we do know. It. Do it, because here's the reality. If you if you want to burn if you hate this conference so much, leave. Oh, that's next. No, no, no. I know, and and it's why I'm saying it. Like I I've had Michigan fans joke about it, text about it. I've had people call in occasionally. So I'll be I'll be serious. Yeah. When you send the information about Rutgers and Ohio State to the NCAA, I encourage you to start calling around. Leave. I'd help you pack. Right. Because here. We're going to stop payment on that $100 million check. And I just want you to know, it's cold out there. You sure you want to leave? Okay. No, I want them in the SEC East with Georgia. Go ahead. Leave. Like, that's my whole point is what options are there? You don't hate the Big Ten. You get largely preferential treatment. You make a ton of money. Because you, you, you that's just it, Mike. Because they get preferential treatment, it's full Karen mode. Don't you know uh, who I am? Don't you know who my dad I, I, you is? You know what? <clears throat> I need to speak to your manager. 248 539 9797. I'll have Rico read some of the ex- excerpts from the AP report. Does this change anything for you? Do you view it the way we do? I don't know. I don't really care. 